and you look at ancient Sumerian records and you, and you look at the history of it, what you find is that this archetype of what these gods are portraying is not just based on forces of nature or the planets. They're, they're real, in, in real beings, they're deities that seem to have a very significant role in our story. It seems that our story begins with them, as I said, with the creation of us. But, but that creation came after the first cities, the first city was created. So Eridu existed before even mankind was created. And it may even be where the biblical Eden is along the, the banks of the Euphrates and Tigris rivers, mm -hmm. that area was much different um, 10 plus thousand years ago than it is now. It was much, it had more water, it was much more lush, and now it's more of a desert. But we have to remember, you know, thing, the, the only constant is, is change, you know, climates change, things change over time. Mm -hmm. And so the way that the, the Sumerian stories really start is that basically there was this need to create a uh, steward, someone who could manage the infrastructure here someone who could be do the role of the Anunnaki because they decided that um, based on the Ajiji's revolt and not wanting to do that work anymore, that we would be created to alleviate the toil of the gods. That's the term they use. So that we would be the ones doing all the things here and, you know, building temples and, and bringing whatever they needed to um, for, for those temples. And what's amazing about Eridu is that's where, if you look at the creator God who created mankind, Enki, meaning uh, Lord of the Earth. E-N means Lord, and Enlil, his, uh, his half-brother, who in, in a lot of the ancient stories really opposes how we were created. He, he, was, he, f he felt quite threatened that we were uh, created in too much like their image and that we would uh, basically ascend and eventually become even greater than he did. So there was a lot of tension between the two of them. And so that's really why um, it really weaves into why this city is so important because Enki, the creator of mankind, along with his sister uh, Ninma, that was where it all began. That was where first civilization first began and our story first began, right there in Eridu.